On one side we have the BLA team Oak Express with the EMB Lab competition filter and on the other side we have the EMB Lab Mocha Pot with the Bialetti filter. Now let's see which mocha gives me the best coffee. Hi everyone, Matteo here. At home I mainly use these two mocha pots, the Bialetti Mocha Express 3 cups and the EMB Lab 3 cups. And I can openly say that EMB Lab Mocha Pot is my first choice. I always get the best result in the cup when I brew the same coffee in the same way using both of these mocha pots. Everyone knows about the Ability Mocha Express, it is very famous. Uh, if you don't, you can watch the video right here where I review the pot and also share some helpful insights. Regarding the EMB Lab Mocha Pot, I can say that here the main feature is the competition filter. ENB Lab is a spin-off project by IMS and is an Italian company leader in production of shower screens and basket for espresso and it's famous all around the world. So it was obvious that the filter here gets most of the attention. The idea of the competition filter has been created to enhance the coffee extraction of the mocha pot. ENB Lab developed a filter with smaller holes, uh, 0. 2 mm diameters than uh, the traditional uh, one from Bialetti that are around uh, 0.8 mm diameters. But as you can see, there are more uh, holes in the same surface area. And this allows a perfect extraction by avoiding high pressured water that could damage the coffee cake. So, because the filter is removable, I try to fit it on the Bialetti mocha pot. And it works, it fits very well. Vice versa, I can put the ability filter on the AB Lab mocha pot. And here I have the idea to compare the two different setups and see the result. On one side we have the Bialetti Mocha Express with the EMB Lab competition filter, and on the other side we have the EMB Lab mocha pot with the Bialetti filter. Now let's see which mocha gives me the best coffee. I will brew the coffee with the same recipe and method, 18 grams of medium roast coffee, ground at 18 regular clicks with a comandante and grinder. I'm distributing the coffee in the basket in the same way for both of them, using a WDT distribution tool. Then I place 140 grams of water in the boiler at room temperature. I'm not placing any paper filter in this case because we want to test the efficiency of uh, the actual mocha pot filters. Close both mochas and let's go to the stove. Okay, now we have both coffees very important to have a uniform cup. Then I'm gonna use two cups. Basically they are the same, there is no mark on the side and I'm going to mark on the bottom uh, which one is the coffee. Uh, I will use for the one brewed with the Bialetti and the AB Lab, I'm gonna put just a B as a Bialetti. For the AB Lab one with the uh, Bialetti filter, I'm going to put a E as EMB lab. I'm going to put the same quantity in both of the cups, the temperature should be the same because I brew them at the same time. And then I will call my, my girlfriend to mix the cups for me so that I can taste them blind. are mixed, I am going to taste both of them. Smell the aroma. This one is more, okay, this aroma is more clean. This one is more intense, but it's not a good quality. I mean, not as good as this.
good coffee. It's good coffee as well. I can find more. Okay, I can feel a bit of grittiness in this on the aftertaste of my tongue. It's a good body, but as a bit of like the mouthfeel, it's not a good quality. This one is more, it's more delicate. I can I can feel some more flavor, more clarity of flavor. This coffee, this one on my left hand side has a more body, but this one more clean. Also, the aftertaste is better. Also, like now it's cooling down. It's it's very pleasant. When this one is not bad, but still feel a bit of grittiness on my tongue. If I have to think about which one is which, I uh, compare about the two filters. I will say that this coffee has been made with a Bialetti filter and this one has been made with a with an EMB lab filter. Um, so I think that this one is the Bialetti Mocha with the EMB lab competition filter and this one is the uh, EMB Lab Mocha with the Belletti filter. I can see, it's B. And that's the E, yeah. I got it. Perfect. I could feel the difference. The same, it was the same coffee, gone the same way, uh, brewed the same way, and it came out at the same time. Uh, the flow was more or less the same and, you know, like, um, I try to manage the extraction uh, in both mockers the same way to make same, the same coffee. I can say that with the EMB lab competition filter, uh, there is a better quality of extraction. Um, we have less uh, fine particles in, in suspension in the coffee and this gives a more clarity and also like a better quality of body. That's why I spot the, the competition filter because I know that this was the characteristic, but I didn't know if, you know, with the Bialetti it was working as well, and I think that worked pretty much uh, amazing. This test was basically something I wanted to, to understand and to share with you, the fact that you can have the Bialetti Mocha Pot Express without problem, but by changing the filter, because you can find on the market the EAB Lab Competition filter, you can just check change your mocha pot, uh, you can change the filter on your mocha and have a better result in the cup. That's the, the goal that I want you to achieve. Good news for mocha pot lovers, AB Lab uh, sell the competition filter with the silicone gasket separately, so you can get the filter and upgrade your uh, mocha pot that you have already. In my case, I have a Bialetti. They produce the competition filter for one cup, uh, three cups and six cups, but I suggest you to go to check online if the size is compatible with your mocha pot. So you can get the competition filter and upgrade your mocha pot. Just to clarify, this video is not sponsored uh, by EAB Lab. I don't get any money, not even if you buy the filter. I want just to be honest with you uh, because for me the goal is for you to achieve a better coffee at home. Now I want to hear from you. What do you think about this video? Do you have the EAB Lab mocha pot or you have the EMB Lab filter? What do you think about it? What's the result in the cup that you get? Uh, are you planning to get one? Um, if you have any question, curiosity about this, uh, you can just drop a comment in the section below. Thank you very much for watching. I can't wait to see you in my next video. And in the meantime, I wish you a wonderful day and delicious coffee. Ciao! Yeah, this is better. Hey, you want to try?